Yo people, Tretch here, aka Sir Worm, aka High Sparrow, aka Shay on Neo, say Shay on Neo. All, all the other names are for the people that know me from SO, but I know you don't, don't care about that. But yeah, it's um, a gameplay today, two gameplays I should say, of me on um, Contraband. And oh, what's the other one on there? I forgot. Oh, I forgot. I forgot. When we get to it, I'll remember. But um, yeah, I'm actually using the core diet on these two gameplays, and I'm actually feeling the core diet these days, to be honest. And today I thought, you know what? Let me try and do a commentary to the video. I've chopped up a bit, so they ain't got a lot of me running around trying to find people, because you know sometimes trying to find people is hard work, as I find these two in here. But sometimes it's like hard work to find people, especially with streaks out. So I've chopped up the video a bit to keep the action going while I'm talking. And let's see if I can talk for 13, 12 minutes. Keep you entertained. Now, I was having a conversation with my son. And I was like, son, what is a good gameplay? What is deemed good enough to upload on YouTube? Yeah. So he said to me, oh, dad, you got to get nukes in it. And I don't get nukes. So all these gameplays I'm loading up. Are you saying they're not good enough? I think they're alright to be honest. I'm like, I'm getting 50 kills plus in kill confirm and TDM, which I think is alright to be fair. But for the 10 people, 5 people that view the videos, what do you think? Do you think that you should only be uploading videos if you get nukes? Or what, high KD? And like, what, if so, what is the, what is the lowest, say highest KD you should be loading up? Because if you watch me watching the videos, I, I try to load up like 50 plus. Sometimes if it's team deathmatch, I might load up 40 something plus. But I try to do as less deaths as possible. But in these two gameplays, I've died. Well, this one I don't die a lot. I die like four times, I think, in this one. But the next gameplay, I die a bit more. But I do get a lot of kills. And I thought, ah, it's still a good gameplay. Why not load it? You know? But that's just a little something for people if they want to leave any comments or want to like in get involved with the conversation. What do you think? Um, a good gameplay is good enough to load on YouTube. Do you think that there's a certain a certain amount of kills you should get before you load it up, or do you have to go on to get nukes only to load it up? Um, I don't know. Now, if you're hearing all the noise in the background, it's because it's a nice day and I'm sitting by the window with the window open. My bad. Should have thought about that before I started recording. But it's a nice day, and um, I haven't got really got the proper setup. I'm using my turtle beaches to actually record the, the microphone on this game, please. So hopefully, it doesn't come out that bad. Because before I've used my headset before, and it was like a bit loud, and you hear feedback and that. But hopefully, this won't come out alright because I've turned down the microphone loudness, etc. But these cars, these cars are killing me. I don't know. I'm going to listen to this back and see if I can even use this commentary after the amount of cars that we going past and there's more to come as well but only 3 minutes in this is going to be way harder than I thought talking for fucking 12 minutes but yeah what I was going to say I don't really know to be fair obviously I'll start the conversation about what do you think is good enough to load up also what do you think do you think that you should load commentaries now I know from previous videos, like when I used to do the um, DC videos, I know people prefer commentaries. Even myself, when I watch videos, I prefer to hear commentaries on them. Even like these days, most people got a face cam. That's another aspect you can bring. Another aspect you can bring to it, like people got the face cam of them playing the game and their reactions when they're playing the game. Now, I don't know if I'll ever be able to do that. And to be fair, I load the videos up for, yeah, for people to watch, but also for my own entertainment, for me to watch back, like, when I think, yeah, I've had a good game base, so I can watch it back. But then I think, oh, I might as well share it with people so they can watch it as well and see what they think, but, yeah, another aspect is face cam. You know? Like, do you think that you should only loading up videos if you've got commentary with them with a face cam? That's another question. Because I know the videos don't get a lot of views, but would they get a lot more views if I was to do commentaries on each one? Which to be personally, oh look that car's killing it, innit? That was a loud one, innit? That's a loud one. 
fuck's sake. Oh, I don't know, man. This, this commentary might be a rip. Oh, and I said rip. Oh, oh man. I can't believe I said rip. But yeah, this, this commentary might be over. But, um, yeah, is that another factor? Do you think you should have to do commentaries when you're loading up your videos? Nah, for the people that do watch videos, usually I don't do commentary. I might do an intro and I just let the game play. Sometimes I do record with my mic on so you hear my reactions and that but more time I don't because my, uh, my house is busy I haven't really got a studio games room per se so my house is busy kids in and out you know so it's like I usually have it muted to be fair so you don't hear my reactions when I'm playing the gameplays but is that another thing you reckon I should be doing more commentaries and to be fair right this is this is real real hard work maybe i should be start doing little notes i'm sure people do that as well have notes down to say what they're going to talk about while they're doing the commentary come like homework you know like you, you go do your homework and you get preparation prepared for the for the thing but this in this gameplay is coming to an end as you can see i've chopped this one up loads because it was hard work finding people. It's always hard work finding people in this map, this country man map for some reason. I don't know why. And look, as you can see, it lagged out there when I got the last kill. But what, 69 and 4? Not bad, not bad. Got the kill cam as well, like best play. Which I think is a um, decent, a decent gameplay to upload. What do you think? I think it's decent. I think it's a decent one. The next one's a bit more, I don't know. Still using the Cordite, but I'm using Seraph on this map. I'm running around I do like a kill confirmed and look at that the map has loaded up was it is it Gideon oh mate imagine the, the map's loaded up and I still didn't get to see what it's called and I've, I've, I've totally forgot what it's called anyway you don't know now anyway on the map now you don't know so yeah I bet you even this commentary sounds a bit muffled because I'm not really talking loud it feels a bit weird sitting there talking to myself to be fair while I'm watching the gameplay but yeah, like I said before, I'll be chopping up these gameplays to make the action kind of flow a bit better. Plus, if I didn't, the videos will be going on for so long because on Kill Confirm, not trying to get all the tags. Trying to keep the tags at a minimum. Even though I do get them, but trying to keep it as low as possible so I can get more kills in. And it seems like the last couple of games, my teammates were doing the same thing. So it kind of worked out. But um, yeah, that's another reason why I chopped up. But as you can see, I said before I said I was using the Cordite, I forgot I was using the Switchblade on this one. And I'm feeling the Switchblade as well. I think the Cordite and the Switchblade are my two favourite guns at this precise moment in time. Now yeah, you can say it's because they've been buffed or they're kinda OP but I don't know man. Like, I feel like the guns on on this game are kinda balanced at the moment to be fair. There's a whole range of guns you can pick that do the job. Some are still trash, but most of the guns like I'd say most of the guns are, are, are doing are doing bits right now. You can pick most of oh, fucking Ajax. Okay. Don't even know why I'm shooting the shields for so long. But it's not what can you do? When you buck at Ajax for your shield, what can you do? Run away, get shot in the back or try shooting for the shield, knowing that the shield is not gonna let you shoot him. It's like I don't know. I don't know. And I'm not gonna sit in my mind about specialists because I like specialists in it. I like specialists. I know some people are like, oh I love we pay bare bones. I haven't played bare bones once because I like the specialist in it. Look, Ajax again. Look, fucking flashbang. But yeah, I, I I like the I like the specialist, especially like when you get to use it for yourself, isn't it? Like obviously, when you get used on you, you, you hate it. But when you get to use it yourself, yeah, it's, it's good. No, and uh, that's just gonna ruin the whole thing. Look at that. So I got what nine minutes into the video, and that's happened. I don't know if you lot got to hear that. But my mic, my headset tried to turn itself off. But we'll see. As I was saying, like, yeah, I like specialists. So I'm not going to complain about them. But it is, it is fucked up when you're on the street and you get killed by one. You know? Especially the fucking dog. Just as I saw Noma there, it reminded me of the dog. Uh, I think the dog's the worst one, to be fair. Because the dog, you just let it loose and it runs around and kills people for you. As where. All the other specialists, you kind of have to like do it yourself, innit, Seraph? You have to get your shots on target, even with, like battery, you have to at least aim it somewhere in the, in the vicinity for it to blow some people up. 
like profits the same you have to like hit people with it crash is not really it's just giving people help so that's all right um ajax at least you gotta run around with the shield and shoot people you know what i mean you can't just press it and it just goes around i think the dog is like the worst specialist because the dog is as hard as nails i don't know why you can't kill him quick like imagine the, i swear they've even debuffed um or nerfed i should say then the strike team just as i said it look, i've got one because these days the strike team is getting killed really quick like, i've got a couple of clips where uh, uh, especially with the pure fire is another specialist you have to run around and use yourself i'm using a pure fire on, on a map and i take out two i take out two strike team easy as pie i just kill them straight away with the uh, specialist so they've nerfed the strike team definitely you can kill them much quicker but the dog no you can't kill the dog you just have to put two clips into the dog to kill the dog which for the life of me i don't get why the dog is so hard you know what i mean i just don't get it <clears throat> but yeah that's one specialist that does wind me up you know other than that i'm feeling all the specialists and i hardly ever use nomads too i don't know i used to use them at the beginning of the game but i don't use it no more but that's one specialist that winds me up and i've done i've done well so far I haven't really talked about anything constructive per se but oh did you not hear that I haven't heard nothing like um thoughts about nothing constructive but I've tried to do a so called commentary over a 30 minute 12 minute gameplay and like I said at the beginning this one's coming to an end soon and like four or five six people that do watch the video let me know is it better that person is coughing up the world is it better with commentary or should I just like drop the commentary out and never try commentary again? Or if I do do a commentary, should I have a subject matter? Should I be hitting a subject? Or should I just put commentary in with the game page? Like just be recording myself as I'm playing and put that and put that in. Which I think are the best ones to be fair, because you get like the real time in game like reactions and disappointments. So for me, I think that's the best one. Because this was this was hard work sitting there constantly talking for 12 minutes. As when you're playing the game, you can just talk and play. But yeah, as I said, here we go. Two game plays. Um, 65 and 11. I know it's a lot of deaths, but still, I thought it was a decent one. Let me know what you think. What is a reasonable gameplay to upload? And what is better, commentary or no commentary or in-game commentary? Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Peace later.